Well, new video starting there. Like one. One. And then it's this one. Am I right? I am right. I love it when I'm right. Look at this little woman fuzzy inside. Okay, now hopefully... Maybe I'll find Red. Maybe he's behind that... Maybe he's behind that door. And he's luck locked. Oh, why? Why would he lock himself? Is he one of the... Is he, a, is he infected? Is he a zombie? Right. God damn it. Well, that's fascinating. Truly. I mean, you can't have filled your notebook. You keep, you keep adding stuff to it. Um, right here. Oh, that's just silly. Oh, come on. Yeah. Flashlight. Whoa. Oh shit, the worms be in here. Oh shit. Oh, is that where they kept it? They don't have feelings. You silly creature. Let's loot first. Oh. Genus... Brycophilia. The grey rock worm. You can find some writing paper. Look at me just using a page. It's like, how? What is this stuff anyway? Some kind of research paper. No matter it's paper, the same. I could find the report has been happening down here. I suppose about a year now. It must be near the end of 21. Uh, I wonder when Christmas was. No matter. Too tired to write now. Mm -hmm. I've been here two days now. I was meaning to record events every day, but I was too busy securing the area. I've used some supplies from the old mining system to warm myself in. It seems as safe a place as any, so those things should stay put for a little while. To that end, it seems I've had, I've had a pretty lucky stumbling here. All this old research is about something similar. After what... After what they did to me... I don't know how I knew it was... How they knew I was coming, or how they managed to follow me in the dark room from work. They have no sense of smell. However, it does seem that they detect movement via vibrations. Lifespan is three days and counting. I can still hear them outside the wall. There's an extra protection. I've locked myself in the smaller study area. They've breached the wall. I've I'm certain they've entered whatever surrounds this room. The future looks increasingly bleak. Good question, I have no answer. All I know is I'd rather take my own life and, and die at the job of these hideous monsters. I have tied a noose. Oh, where's the noose? I'm not seeing a noose. You're a bad suicidal. Everyone knows you meant to leave a noose for the news reporters to come and look at and everyone to go, ooh. I guess I can't go through. What a shame. How are you then? Ah! 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 Oh. Mm -hmm. God. They have left the blood. Only... Alone in the dark, the darkness eats pastures in hell. Eat meets mummy. 
What? God damn it, frictional games. Oh yeah, let, yeah. Why is he doing this? Oh god! They're alive! Jesus Christ, I didn't realise that. I thought it was like a decoration. Good thing they haven't found me, actually. <sighs> okay, so then the code must be amongst these. Sure. Yeah. Ugly things. And you like, I smash these in. It's the guy of the message, obviously. Or, oh, or red. Maybe it's red. Wait, where's the code? Seeds devour. So, Golo Doctor. What? It's relatively normal. <laughs> oh God. Um. While you hunt for those delicate, uh, melt-in-your-mouth, mousy morsels, there are places you should not go, for, for fear of death. The Reaper lives here, just like you and I. And just like you and I, he must ingest the living flesh of those less fortunate than him. There is a small place that I do not want you to visit, even on your holidays, because it is dark and evil place that I have been. When the darkness has overwhelmed my small, decaying mind, some bad things have flowed from my mind and through my pen. The brilliant blue ink itself seemed to turn to blood into my grace. And by the way, should you turn peckish, red is at its finest sautéed with a little engine oil. <laughs> what? So that was red? But he died? What? No, he died! Someone must have been in a great deal of pain. Red's in pain. I think he said that a few times. I like to put my ears in pain. Although he's a really cool character. I like him. In a really odd way. Considering... Or maybe he wrote this and then someone else came in. Fine now. God, this is so fucking creepy. I can't see any numbers. Do they think they've left the blood only? Can okay, Red will just tell me the combination? He wants me to come and get him, doesn't he? I mean, for a bit he was like, uh, no, lol, just go away. And I'm like, no, I'm going to come in. I'm going to come in, Red. Maybe I use, actually, what if I use the no? Maybe the game will do it for me. I don't trust Red to be useful just yet. So far, the only really useful hint he's given me, I think, is don't touch the walls in that trap I led you to. And, what was that? Someone just spoke. Ah! Somebody just spoke. Ah, yeah! Ah, there we are! 1371! Brilliant. I am a genius. I mean, I was hoping maybe it would just like say, Oh, here we are, I see the password now, but it's, yeah, that's great. Why do they have a piece of UV written ink paper on them? Silly miners. That's not how you read the password. Yeah. Hey, well. No, 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 come on, shake, do your worst. Except sending the worm after me, don't do that again, that was scary. Wonder what that was then. I was like, hmm. Section C. 
Yeah, it's a bit odd. Nothing else seems to have respawned since the first level. Maybe that was just to keep me scared and like put emphasis on, hey, don't fight. Damn it, I pressed 7. Yep, new area. Where am I? 